Another meeting for the two leaders has already been arranged. Come July, they will hold a trilateral summit with their Japanese counterpart on the sidelines of the G20 summit in Hamburg. According to our Kwan jang -ho, other than strengthening ties, North Korean issues will be front and center. It's been confirmed that South Korea, the U.S. and Japan will hold a trilateral meeting on the sidelines of next week's G20 summit in Germany. Both Chung Wade and the White House confirmed on Thursday that President Trump has invited Moon Jae-in and Shinzo Abe for a working dinner on July 6th. It'll be the first trilateral meeting since both Moon and Trump took office this year. While several issues will be on the table, North Korea is expected to dominate the proceedings as the three leaders discuss how best to cooperate and tackle the regime's nuclear threat. President Moon will be arriving in Germany a day earlier to meet with the German Chancellor Angela Merkel in Berlin. Again, North Korea will be high on the agenda, with Moon not only looking to garner support to deal with the North Korea nuclear issue, but also looking for understanding as South Korea continues its drive to re-engage with the regime. The Blue House is also said to be working to arrange other bilateral talks with China and Japan during Moon's time in Germany. Meanwhile, the first face-to-face -face meeting between Donald Trump and Russian President Vladimir Putin has also been confirmed for Hamburg as well. With several thorny issues in the air, such as Russia's meddling in the 2016 elections, Russia's occupation of Crimea and the conflict in Syria, many will be closely watching how Trump handles the proceedings and how far he pushes Putin on those issues. The president's national security adviser, H.R. Master, has said that so far there is no specific agenda to the talks and that it'll be whatever the president wants to talk about. Kwon Jang-woo, Arirang News.